Alright, what is going on everybody? It is Tristan and today in this video what I got going on for you guys is we're going to discuss the upcoming Nike Dunk Low Panda restock. Uh, and one thing I want to say just kind of to get out of the way, it's on August 11th and the main thing I was going to say is sorry that I didn't get back to all the comments from yesterday's video. There was a good amount. Some are pretty long but I'm going to get back to them today. And I know there was a couple errors I made in the video like talking about the hyperspaces, forgot that those were an Asia, uh, Asia exclusive in 2019. Uh, you know, that Rat V3 is actually being a restock. I should have, you know, looked, you know, in the charts and I probably would have seen that. Uh, but, you know, it's a little bit hard to tell with the hyperspaces, but I could have definitely just looked that up. But my bad on that. Uh, everybody asking about the foam runner holder cell thing. I put that towards the end of the video. So just, you know, kind of go check that out towards the end of it. But let's talk about this Dunk Low restock coming up. If you guys want to check out my Instagrams on the screen, feel free to give me a follow below. And of course, check out my cook group coming soon. We have added so much, like in the last day, so many things. The food discounts are even better, even more bots support more eco providers uh, more people to help out with different discounts across different places sneakers monitors people that you know provide really good info on shock drops things like that we got a really solid team that's developed so feel free to go check it out here we're adding a backdoor today as well so we're gonna have backdoors and yeah i mean I'm, I'm telling you when we're gonna have everything you need it's gonna be awesome that's everything i need to say i hope you all will enjoy and let's kind of get started here so first things first again this the men's and grade school pairs are the ones that are dropping uh on august 11th at 10 a.m eastern time so don't forget west coast gonna be three hours earlier and i always feel bad for my people over on the west coast y'all gotta wake up so early for these drops but i'm hoping that you guys do hit on this one i'm hoping that this nike app restock actually has a little bit more stock than the last few ones have because i, I just want to show y'all this i just want to show y'all this okay so obviously demand's not down but <laughs> the prices are going up and they have <laughs> the prices are going up these aren't like these are the unbreakables look how many sales 153,000 sales on one platform imagine how many have sold across instagram across ebay across go all the other sneaker platforms like that's <laughs> are these <laughs> what is happening <laughs> but i mean i know what's happening you know that just so many people want these this is like the new air force one i mean it's they're now the same price as them you saw how they've raised air forces from 90 to 110 dollars so people calling this new air force one i guess not in comparison of how they look but in terms of uh you know how nike's dropping them and how they're trying to push them you know and seeing them on everybody's feet fully agree with that statement so aside from that i guess you know just kind of the only thing that was, this page really shows is the retail and drop time so don't forget august 11th i told you all the time you guys again it's all right here on the screen and then yeah, the 110 dollar retail which is just it's ten dollars more than it used to be but i mean I, I, let's see how much nike raises it in the future maybe they'll make air forces 120 because you know nike is just cashing out right now uh with this whole you know inflation and everything you know because they're not affected by it you know big companies you know they, they always get it easy during times like this the government will support them and uh just th th seeing them raise prices is just like okay guys really you're just you're just trying to make more money from people that don't have as much right now welcome to america but aside from that a couple other things i want to discuss let's just kind of get into the resale for the shoe uh again this pair originally dropped i don't even know why i'm mentioning that y'all know when this dropped last year and looking at the prices <laughs> Big sizes are still up there in value, man. I mean, look at this, size 12s, 250, 12 and a half, 260. So, of course, as I always mentioned, size 10 and a half and above, those will have a different range in price than, uh, you know, of course, uh, size 10 and below uh, after this drop happens on the Nike app. But I don't really have an estimation. I mean, my estimation would be that these will probably drop another $10 in price. Really won't be affected by it too much because again, they've been going up in price. So demand is really high right now. So this drop will only maybe make it go flat for a little bit, drop like $5 again. 10 at most is what I think but you never know what will happen if people really need the money right now which is the case it could drop further of course maybe in those smaller sizes but for the big sizes those will just shoot right back up to you know kind of 250 and i'm not encouraging a hold in the sneaker i do not recommend that this is not a pair that you want to hold for the future because it constantly restocks there's no uh, real point to that you'll just lose money so just take your money if you win Best suggestion I have. And of course, for the grade school pairs, we'll get into this. I mean, guys, look at how many pairs have sold in the last three days in StockX. 2,500 pairs for the adult sizes. A thousand in the kid sizes. That's I think that's probably the highest on StockX. As I've said, Panda Dunks have been the highest selling sneakers on StockX for a while. I think the Turtle Doves are a close second uh, or, or close to first just to say the least at least when pairs get in hand people will be buying them more i'm sure but even more people are going to be buying these in the next few days you know after the restock happens it's and you know it's just it's bound for these to go up uh, up in demand a little bit you know people will be buying them more because they'll be down in price so aside from that looking at the uh grade school pairs right here again kind of a range of 150 to 190 my personal recommendation since the grade school pairs do retail at 90 dollars and after shipping and everything mainly tax you'll probably pay around 95 98 dollars i haven't actually uh, you know, gotten a grade school pair in a while, so I won't remember that. For the adult pairs, it's like 115 usually or something like that after tax and everything. I think I'm, or like 118, something like that. 
Uh, but yeah, aside from that, what I think these ones will drop down to, I mean, again, another probably $10, maybe $15 on this one, since again, the demand is a little bit lower and they probably will drop a good amount of the grade school ones. Not as many as the adult ones, I'll think, uh, I think, but don't forget the women's pairs are dropping as well. I should have, you know, put the resale up for that, but it'll, it'll probably, you know, again, another $10 drop, something like that. But again, demand is super high for these right now. I've said that multiple times, so I'm definitely just going to stop trying to say that. And that's really all I need to mention. Resell is, you're not going to lose any pair any size really it's, especially in the grade school ones you know you can get a three and a half wide that's that's a dub that's a quick uh forty dollars right there so i fully recommend going for any size in the grade school one of course bigger one you get more you make uh that's just kind of the case with the panda dunk low uh, unless it's a six wide seems like so maybe like i don't know it, it really just just if you buy it any size you're good i don't know why i need to make it sound difficult there. That's really the basics to it. It's not hard. So go for any one. But aside from that, looking at these, kind of my method uh, to cop in on Nike. Again, you can't make uh, can make multiple accounts. And again, in my Discord coming soon, August 18th, August 19th, that's when we're aiming to launch somewhere around then. We will have some proxies that you guys will be able to use. But of course, uh, there's plenty of proxy providers that you can use online. I recommend like, you know, like uh, Sauce Proxies or um, Olympus Proxies. Uh, I'm trying to think of a couple others, but those are like two of the main ones that are pretty good that I can name off the top of my head, those proxies right there. You guys can use those. And basically what you do is on each Nike account that you have right up here, you install BP Proxy Switcher, right? And you would just edit, click edit right here. You would paste your proxies in. You only need one proxy to show you just paste one of maybe like the 10 or 25 that you would get. And what you would actually do is you see how you have an account right up here. So for each account that you have up there, you put one account on each Chrome profile. So you see I have multiple Chrome profiles. You could actually go to nike.com and make multiple accounts. And you could install, again, BP Proxy Switcher on each one of those profiles. And then again, you would go into it, click edit, and you would do that for each uh, different uh, browser that you have open, which are browser tab, but it wouldn't be tabs like this, you know, it actually would be, you know, you would go to file and you would uh, click, you would open a new window and in each window you'd have uh, a Google account logged in. Uh, you really don't need a Google account. You just need, you know, a Nike account logged in with the BP proxy switcher and then a proxy on each, uh, you know, uh, window that you have open with that account logged in and that's really the basics to it so again bp proxy switcher you can just download as a chrome extension it's really easy not something hard to do so you know go ahead and do that if you all want to And uh, yeah, that's really all the basics I need to mention. I would, uh, you know, be promoting this group and saying, you know, join here if you guys need help, but that is not gonna be launching in time for this drop, sadly. We're doing a few more things with testing, setting up the group. It's looking really solid. So I appreciate you guys for, you know, staying tuned and being patient with me there, but it's gonna provide everything that you guys need. So really, we're gonna be, I'm gonna be posting something soon, you know, showing some uh, success on this Instagram. So that'll at least be, uh, you know, coming shortly, but that's really everything I need to mention about how you guys can cop this restock short and simple and to the point. I don't really feel like I need to drag this on. No rifles or anything are going to be releasing this sneaker. This is going to be a Nike app exclusive, just like most of these Panda Dunk Low restocks. We may see a couple other places raffle them off, but I would not expect that. So that's just at least one I want to say for now. But of course, keep your eyes peeled. And that's everything I really need to say. Uh, so of course, you want to check me out on Instagram, feel free. Just showed you all the cook group. So Hype Lab CG, feel free to give that a follow right there on Instagram. And of course, feel free to subscribe and like for more content like this. Like, well, I didn't even put one at the start of the video. I don't even think I said subscribe and like, but hey, Hey, no big deal. If you enjoy the video, you're probably still here. So again, like, well, I think I said it was like 250. deep. So there we go. Just came up with it in my head. But leave any questions, comments, anything else down below. I will be sure to look at it and respond. Uh, if it's a good question or anything that you're confused about, you're just trying to let me know that you're excited for the drop or, you know, just let me know something, then, you know, drop that below. So that's everything. I'm Tristan. Thank you guys for watching. And I will catch you all in the next video tomorrow. Peace.